Hi, and welcome back to our YouTube channel. In this article, weeks after Democrat impeachment fails, Nadler investigates second impeachment opportunity. The impeachment push seems to have backfired on the Democrats. Trump is stronger than ever, so what is Nadler up to? Donald is enjoying high approval polls and record fundraising. In fact, few would even question his 2020 re-election chances. Some House Democrats have learned their lesson. In recent weeks, they've been backing down. But not Jerry Nadler. You might remember how he tried to steal the spotlight during the Senate trial. Adam Schiff and Nadler butted heads numerous times. Now, as the rest of his party turns tail and runs, Nadler apparently wants to ramp things up. From Politico, House Democrats are seeking interviews with the four career prosecutors who quit the case of Roger Stone. Judiciary Committee Chairman Jerry Nadler, Democrat from New York, requested the interviews in a Friday letter to Attorney General William Barr. That also includes broader demands for documents and testimony about allegations of political interference by Trump in the work of the Justice Department. LOL, really? Now that the Roger Stone case is history, Nadler is trying to pull a fast one. He sent a letter to A.G. Barr requesting interviews with DOJ lawyers. These are the same lawyers who quit in a huff over the Roger Stone case. Nadler is also trying to get documents to prove accusations against Trump. It seems the Democrat believes the president is interfering with the DOJ. I guess Nadler forgot that the DOJ reports to the president. The agency is under his authority, so something tells me Trump has every right to be involved in DOJ work. Nadler seems to believe that Trump is politically interfering with the DOJ. Oh, you mean the way Obama's administration was involved in the FBI's wiretapping of the Trump campaign? Or how Bill Clinton met with former A.G. Lynch just before the FBI dropped their case against Hillary? I don't remember Nadler investigating his own on these very questionable circumstances. I guess Nadler is only concerned with political interference within the DOJ when it doesn't benefit his side. But I don't believe these letters are going to twist Barr's arm. House Democrats refused to issue subpoenas during the impeachment inquiry. I wonder if Nadler will bother to do the same. Share to tell everyone about Nadler's pathetic new scheme.